So welcome back to Talking with Jedi. I'm your host, Tank Solo, here to bring you another interview with another Jedi Master, and I believe, if I remember right, his name is Coyote Skywalker. You remember correctly? So I heard you just came back from a big, big battle. What was it over? Well, the Resistance sent me to Kashyyyk to help defend a Wookiee family from the First Order. Really? I distorted tr stormtroopers, and while I was at it, I kicked Kylo Ren's ass. Well, now that's quite an adventure. Now let me By ask. literally dueling a blaster and a lightsaber. Now let me ask. You can't defend about... Was it Chewbacca's family? Well... Actually, not that I, if I remember correctly, because I'm, my brain's kind of foggy because of the brandy. <laughs> yeah, if I remember right. Hmm. I haven't heard from, Chewba from Chewbacca in a while. So... He and Han are off on some talk eyed adventure. Alright. Well... On the show here, we like to ask our guests to show off their lightsaber or weapon of choice. And kind of explain to us how it felt building their weapon. I have two weapons of choice. I got a blaster plus a lightsaber. But the one you built is the one we want to hear about. The lightsaber. That's the thing. I cousin built both of them. Well, why don't we start with the lightsaber? Since that seems to be more typical of a Jedi. That's the thing. I'm not a typical Jedi. No, you're not. As a matter of fact, as an indication from our battle records, you're not a typical Jedi at all. You're one of the strongest in the Order. You've only lost two times. I think the last one was a draw. My opponent hit too hard. <laughs> so anyhow, we would like to see your lightsaber and hear your story. I had to cut off story. both his hands. <laughs> so let's see your lightsaber and tell us about its crystal and how you got it and how you came to find the parts. Well, the crystal I found at an old uh, Jedi temple, and the hilt I found on an, uh, on an abandoned freighter. Really? So you found all your parts on an abandoned freighter? Well, I found a crystal in an, in an abandoned Jedi temple. The hilt I found on an abandoned freighter. So. In the middle of in the in the dead of space. So as we all ask here on the show is, uh, well, what was it like during your trial to get your crystal? Because as we all know, the Jedi younglings it was were together a bitch. for the Jedi gathering. It was a bitch. Mind you, there was a bunch of uh, discrepant battle droids there, and I just blasted through. You see, my mom was a Jedi, and yet my dad was a Sith. How they got along and had me, I have no freaking clue. How they got along, along, along enough, long enough to have me, I, I'll never know. I guess that's one reason why I'm able to use Sith Lightning and also the Jedi Mind Trick. Hmm. Yeah, I admit the Force Lightning did did help quite a bit when I faced Kyle Ren, though. He didn't know how to defend against that shit. <laughs> so, you said you custom built your blaster. Where did you get all the parts? Did you buy them, trade for them, get them uh, as gifts? Combination of the black market and old freighter parts. Hmm. You sure you didn't get it off a website? I'm positive. Mm-hmm. You down on me, bitch? <laughs> it's just I had the exact same blaster. You realize? I have had several drinks in me. It's not wise to piss off a drunk old Jedi. All right. So we want to ask one last question before you go. And do your thing, drunk. Why do you drink when you're a Jedi? Because I, I have a lot of people, to, a lot of responsibility and people to take care of. Duh. But why? 
I always have a few drinks to celebrate a, a successful mission. Just become a habit. English bartender, top me up, please. Sparky, please don't. Oh, come on. Well, this has been Talking with Jedi. Here with Coyote Skywalker. I almost forgot his name. And, uh, this has been a fun little episode. And hopefully everyone else can love it, too. Stay tuned yeah, to the hopefully. Force. May the Force be with you.